And nakita niya how amazing our God is. At nakita niya yung main uh, attributes ng Panginoon. Dito natin matatagpuan sa salmo na ito. From the verse, first verse until the last. How the God that we know has these attributes. And how the God that we know knows us. Amen. Praise the Lord. So kung titignan natin, nakikita nyo dyan sa screen? Yes po. Amen. The prior section from before 23 and up, makikita natin doon yung attributes ng Panginoon, ng Diyos na alam natin at alam ko na kilala ng bawat isa. The God of heaven, the King of kings, the Lord of lords. Amen. Doon makikita natin from verse 1 to 6, God's omniscience, that He is the God who knows everything. Amen. Makikita rin natin doon from verse 7 to 12 that about God's omnipresence, that the God, the all-present God, is everywhere. Wala tayong pwedeng pagtaguan. Oh, hallelujah, na hindi niya alam. Makikita rin natin <coughs> from verse 13 to 16 about God's omnipotence. That He is mighty. That the all power God that we know, that the God who creates the universe, who created the universe and everything in it, and even us, He, the God that who created everything had fearfully and wonderfully created us. Amen. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Amen. I will just elaborate something about this concerning the next verses that David wrote. From verse 17 to 22. Doon siya nag-marvel how God is so good. Nakita niya ang lahat ng ito kung kaya't nabanggit niya. And declare and rejoice how precious to me are your thoughts, O God. How vast is the sum of them. When I count them, they would outnumber the grains of sand. Wow. When I awake, I am still with you. Then there is a swiss of emotions about this. Telling him, telling God, Oh, hallelujah. He lamented on this wickedness and asked God imprecatorily, If only you, God, would slay the wicked. And he asked God to let those wicked away from him, away from me. You who are bloodthirsty, they speak. He said that those wicked persons speak of God that you know with evil intent. He said, your adversary misuse your name. They speak of you with evil intent. And boast, do I not hate those who hate you, O Lord, and abhor those who are in rebellion against you? I have nothing but hatred to them. I count them as my enemies. Then he comes back to his senses and tell the God who, who is the recipient of his prayer to let the God search him. He said, search me, O God, and know my heart. Test me and know my anxious thoughts. See if there is any offensive way in me and lead me in the way everlasting. Amen. Amen. Amen.